a rational solution. The European Council chief in Egypt on Monday called for delaying Brexit. It's, for me, it's absolutely clear that if there's no majority in the House of Commons to approve a deal, an extension would be a rational uh, solution. But May said inking a deal by the deadline is still possible. I believe it is within our grasp to leave with a deal on the 29th of March. And I think that's where all our energies should be focused. Uh, any delay is a delay. It doesn't address the issue. It doesn't resolve the issue. It may not resolve the issue, but it could be necessary. There's a new thorn in May's side. This week, the Labour Party will put forward its own Brexit plan. If it doesn't pass, party leader Jeremy Corbyn says they'll back a second referendum. It's a dramatic shift for the party, which is deeply divided over Brexit. The change in approach comes after nine Labour lawmakers resigned last week, threatening to take more with them. It's not clear what kind of referendum Corbyn supports, but the mere possibility of one could threaten May's deal by siphoning off the support of MPs who would have backed her in order to avoid a no-deal Brexit.